Today we're going to show you how to create a wiki project for your Haiku course. Let's say that you're wrapping up your performance assessment and maybe you want your students to have one location where they would submit all of the pieces of that performance task. A wiki project offers a great solution for you to be able to do that. So on my ELA page, just like any other thing I'm going to place in Haiku, I'm going to add a content block to create this wiki project. I'm going to make sure I click on the Connect and Assess tab and then the very last option for wiki project. I need to give my project a title, so maybe Unit 1 Performance Task. I can type in the directions here for what my project is going to be and that way my students know exactly what they need to put inside their wiki project. So let's say I have my performance task. I'm going to copy and paste in here so I don't have to retype all of that information. So here's information from my performance task. Let's say part one, they had to create an outline for a national park brochure. Part two, they had to insert an image of their national park welcome sign. Again, the wiki project just allows for that project creation and a place for all of it to be bookmarked nice and neat together and packaged when they turn it in. So next I'm able to choose what type of wiki project I want it to be. Is it a class project where they're all working on one collaborative project? Is it a section project where maybe sections of the class or particular students are working together? Is it a group project where I have my students grouped ahead of time and I'm able to select them for the project? Or a personal project where every student creates their own project? For today's sample I'm going to choose a personal project and I'm going to choose next. Next is the project feedback settings. Teacher review means students can only see their own wiki site, which means they'll be working on it, they turn it in, and that the teacher and the student that it belongs to are able to make comments back and forth. Peer review means that other students will be able to see it and make comments, but they're not going to be able to make any changes. And then peer view means that they're only going to be able to view and comments will be disabled. So peer review allows for comments, peer view does not. I'm going to leave it on teacher review because this is something they're sending to me as a final grade. So I only want them to be able to view their own project. Next is to schedule the due date. I'm going to set the due date to next week. If I have gradebooks set up, I could create a gradebook entry for my wiki projects and I'm going to click save. Next, we can see the block has been created now for my wiki project. The students are able to see what type of project, when it's due, how many points it's worth, and then to view projects, they would click on the link here. I can see I have one student. As the teacher, I'm able to set the grade here. The student has not started the wiki project, so in order for them to start it, they would click on this link where it says Start Wiki Site. And if I do that, you're able to see what they get is a page that looks just like a haiku page for them to insert all of their information. So they're able to add content blocks, they're able to add pages, and that way it's a nice place for them to organize the material in something that is familiar to them. And that is how you create a wiki project inside Haiku Learning.